if you attend an adjournment, if you do not sign in or stand in with your key card, we will ask you to repeat the adjournment.
We operate a zero tolerance policy regarding disposal of any refusing to the sea. And we kindly request your cooperation in this regard and to refrain from discarding any type of waste overboard, no matter how small it may be. Please use the receptacles conveniently located in your stateroom and throughout the ship. With regards to PA announcements, all emergency announcements would be automatically broadcast into the staterooms and around the ship for everyone to hear. However, as for non-emergency announcements, which are kept to a minimum, these can be only heard by turning on your television and sending it to the bridge camera channel 22, then turning up the volume. These announcements are also broadcasted in the public areas and corridors. Your awareness of the sea conditions is important, and we ask you to take extra vigilance in the event in inclement weather. Be sure to always keep your fingers away from any door jams, as doors on ships are designed to close automatically. Also, whenever possible, as you proceed around the ship, especially when using the stairs, please use the handrails. Be aware of the elevated door sill when entering and exiting the bathroom of your stateroom, also that leads to off or on the open deck. Be reminded that the outer decks and tiled floors are slippery when wet and can also be slippery on days of high humidity. We encourage you to wear rubber soled shoes and be cautious when walking or jogging on the outer decks. Norwegian Escape is equipped with 18 lifeboats. In addition, there are 24 life rafts. Lifeboats and life rafts are provided with emergency food, water, and other survival items that are manned by well trained crew members. In the event of an actual emergency at the captain's order and under the direction of the officers and staff, you will be escorted in groups to the lifeboats, which are located on deck 7. The evacuation from the monster station will be done in an orderly fashion, following designated evacuation paths to the lifeboats. There will be crew members located inside and outside of the lifeboats to assist you. Once everyone has embarked into the lifeboats, the ship personnel will bring the lifeboats safely into the water. Calmness and strict obedience to the orders given by the officers in charge in any emergency situation is essential for the safety of all guests and crew. The captain will keep both guests and crew informed of the developing situation through public address announcements assigned to the cruise director. A video with additional safety information is broadcasted on TV Channel 10. This video will show you the correct procedure that you will follow to evacuate from the muster stations to the lifeboats. If you should have any further questions about our safety on board, we kindly ask you to contact guest services in order to organize a meeting with our safety officer. Also, should you have any further questions about any aspect of our safety plan, officers will remain on deck to address them. As fire is one of the greatest threats for our vessel while at sea, due to the recent safety concerns regarding the Samsung Galaxy Note 7, Guests who are found in possession of this device or if left unattended in a stateroom, it will be confiscated by our crew for safekeeping. The device will be remaining in a possession that is in a safe and monitored location for the duration of the cruise. Guests can reclaim their device at the conclusion of the cruise from the reception desk. We thank you for your understanding and compliance with this safety policy. Ladies and gentlemen, the mandatory lifeboat drill has now been completed.